So here is my new uranium glass. Uh, this is a juicer, a small bowl with a pour thing that I got for like $21. Uh, I had, I bought three of these Sunday cups on eBay and I got all of these for about $5 a cup. And then I got this candle holder. And it all started with me wanting to buy martini glasses to have a martini party under black light. And I bought one of these exact kind on uh, eBay again and got these for all five of them for I think $18. So that was my best buy. Here's one of my favorites. This is a Vaseline, I believe. It glows, so it's something. Uh, Bell. Here's a bowl that's identical to my mom's, uh, bowl she got from her great aunt. There's all the packaging. And then this bowl, I thought was Vaseline glass, but you can't see through it. And it lights up. I'll show you all in a second. So it's the daytime. It's not going to get too dark in here. Because of the beautiful window. But here we go. I would suggest everyone get a black light flashlight if you want to look at it uh, at antique stores. You can, I'll go to the other corner of it and show you. You can be that far away and it just lights up. Uh, so there's the juicer again. The bowl with the pour spout. I don't know what this glass is. That doesn't look like Vaseline glass. It's too opaque. Uh, I did an identical one to my great aunt's. I now have 11 total of these Sunday dishes so I can have a Sunday party. I have six total. I have one more at home of these. Uh, so I have a little six person martini party. And I can get this bell blessed and drive demons crazy allegedly, an exorcist said. So anyways, uh, yeah, I'm starting to collect this glass. Uh, I plan on buying it like several pieces every month, preferably around $100 total uh, to have at my new house. And I want my whole first floor, or at least the kitchen and dining room, lit up by black light uh, at nighttime so this would all glow.